happening everybody eric with furloughs aquatics here i'm hanging out in the uh reptile room this evening well so i guess some of you might remember about two months ago i put out a video on the eastern collared lizards our female was holding eggs and uh well a couple weeks after that she actually laid the eggs and we uh we put them in an incubator and uh today uh, we've got hatchlings, so we are super excited, super duper excited. And I just wanted to let you guys see just how cute these guys really are. Because I honestly, right now, I may be a little biased just because they're mine. Uh, I don't think there's anything cuter. And uh, if you disagree, oh well. No, I'm just kidding. Anyways. So I'm gonna show you guys their enclosure and show you, hopefully we can catch some of them out. And uh, here we go, just bear with me cause I gotta get down on the ground here and I gotta spin the camera around so I might make y'all a little bit dizzy. Just bear with me, all right? There's a little dude right there, he's taking a nap. Drank himself to sleep, imagine that. I'm gonna go ahead and spin around here and uh, give y'all a little panoramic view of the enclosure here. Oh, we got a little guy. Oh, don't run away, dude. dude hanging out over here he's just chilling chilling on his log there's a total of six in here but i think the other four are sleeping right now so we're not going to get too much of a show because it is the evening time and usually their lights are off right now but i wanted to turn it on oh there's a third one right there check him out poking his little head out just to say hello to everybody Say hi, little dude. But uh, these guys, uh, we've been waiting for these guys for, it takes them about 50 days, I wanna say, to hatch from, from egg to uh, hatchling. As you can see, we got some food in there for them. It's the, we call them the flightless fruit flies. The scientific name is the Melanogaster. I don't know if they show up on here. They're pretty, they're pretty doggone small. But they got a nice little pad going on here. Plenty of stuff for them to jump around. These guys are jumpers, man. The parents, I get up in the morning before all the lights come on and you can hear them jumping around trying to catch crickets and stuff. They make a big thud and they're not even that big of a lizard. And uh, these little guys, they were, they were some feisty little boogers when they were born. We were trying to get them out of their incubator to put them in, put them in here. And they were snapping at us. I don't know if they thought we were food or what, but it was, it was pretty comical. All right, guys, I'm just going to give you all one last look, kind of far away look at the enclosure. And again, these are the Eastern Collared Lizards. There's a couple different morphs of them. These are, I think, I believe these are just the, the regular morphs. You know, they got some greens, blues, yellows, and browns on them. But why well, they call them the Collared Lizards because they have like a black and orange collar around their neck. And it's really pretty, especially when, especially the male when he's in breeding mode. All right, guys, so there you have it. That's our uh, new baby Eastern Collared Lizards. They are they are cute. They are something else. Very comical to watch. But I really, really appreciate you guys uh, taking the time out to watch this video. Um, I'm going to have plenty more. I'm going to be doing a series on these little guys as they grow. So uh, you're not going to want to miss that. Uh, if you're not subscribed to me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. 
So that way you get notified when I do post, do post more, more videos about these guys. Um, anyways, guys, I really do appreciate you guys once again. And I will catch you all in the next one. Peace.